my top five lip glosses or lip details. This is for y'all. I'm going to give all of the secrets on how I make my Sims lips look so luscious and plump and juicy and thick. The first one of all freaking time. Shout out to Peachy Fairy. I am actually mutuals with them on Twitter and oh my god, I've loved Peachy Fairy since I first found their highlight in The Sims 4. Oh my god, I love Peachy Fairy down. So the first one is called Peachy Fairy Glossier Lip Gloss Overlay. So when you download this, it's actually going to be in a different category, I believe. I changed it to where it is now in the lip category, just so that it's easier for me. I believe that when you first download it, it might be in like the skin details category. It, it might be in a different category because it's an overlay. It's supposed to go on top of the lip gloss, but I like personally using it as a lip gloss in the lip category. So that's why I have it here. It has different intensities and a slider to where you can change it yourself but y'all look at this lip like oh my gosh it just looks so freaking good and if you wanted to actually change the color underneath this is what I use I go to skin details and I go to I think it's mouth details I have the northern Siberia winds blush and lip detail so I actually can use this and change the underneath lip color if I like really 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 wanted to I personally like that like more natural lip look so this this is perfect but yes i love these lips so freaking much another one as well and it might be in the skin details so let's go to the body oh please don't do anything crazy please okay y'all so i found it it is under tattoos i do have wicked whims on so i'm trying to like get close enough to where like y'all don't see everything but hold on let me all right y'all so this is the other one as well this one's found in tattoos this one has a lot of different options which is kind of leading me to believe that it might actually be a different one altogether so let me go to peachy let me look at my mod manager and let's go to peachy Perfect. So it is two different ones. The first one that I used was called the Glossier Lip Gloss Overlay. The second one that I'm using is called the Lust Lip Gloss Overlay. So I'm gonna also make sure I have that one linked as well. But yes, this one is also found in tattoos. This one has a lot of different options. This is beautiful. This is absolutely beautiful. Like just a very subtle but really nice lip shine. I'm in love. Moving right on along, we have the Mabelie Nature Lip Gloss. So this is the Nature Gloss. I love this one. This is actually the one that I was using at the beginning of this video. Oh my god, just beautiful. It comes in like different colors. It comes with a slider so you can adjust to whatever you want. I'm really in love with all of these colors. You really cannot go wrong. It's just a very nice, beautiful light lip gloss that just looks very realistic and very just just amazing there's really nothing else i could say about it um it's just perfect it really works great if you want to try and find like a nude um but like a glossy nude you can change the opacity you can change like the brightness you can just really make it your own shout out to maybelline store the next person that we have is lady simmer who created these fluffy cloud lip glosses now i actually don't even remember how i found this or how i stumbled across this but i'm so glad that i did this lip gloss is beautiful it is just so buttery looking and just so it's just so pretty i'm like oh my god i love using this lip gloss on my y2k girlies because i just feel like it's just a very y2k vibe but it is just so pretty you can turn down the opacity as well i did notice however with this lip gloss if i do turn the opacity down a little bit there is just a small bit of like pixels i don't really know what that's from i'm like my graphic settings are all the way turned up everything's on high so i'm not really too sure why that is there it's not just this lipstick it's for a lot of other different custom content with sliders as well but if anybody knows you know let me know in the comments but yeah i'm like i really love this one the fourth one that we have is by msq sims and it's called the mary lone lipstick this one is a classic for me i use this one so freaking much this one i just love because it fits my sims lips no matter what sims i have no matter what lip preset no matter what shape how big it will fit my sims lips down sometimes you have like some lipsticks that kind of like change the shape of the lips 
Okay, now it doesn't want to show that. Now everybody's just perfect. But yeah, sometimes you have those lip glosses or those lipsticks that kind of change the shape. Oh my god, this one's such an honorable mention. This is Cosmo Sim lipstick number six. This one's so good. Oh my gosh. This one's really good too. If you're looking for a more natural lip but we're looking for lip glosses okay so yes anyways this one just fits the shape of any sims lips so well and yeah i just i love using this one especially for my more dramatic lipstick because it has like that outline it just looks so good you can change the lip line as well all right y'all so the last one that we are going to get into is actually a lip mask overlay so we're gonna just put these lips on her right now we're gonna put these ones on her and then we're gonna go to faces we're gonna go to we're gonna go to mouth details and here it's going to be so this is the sammy xox lip mask overlay and this what this adds it is a huge list of overlays that kind of change the details and the dimensions of the lips so you can go through these and you can find like all different types of different overlays based on what you're looking for they have lip liners they have like just shadows and things that kind of just make the lips look different i added this to the list because i found myself using this so much it really adds so much detail to the lips and just makes the lips look that much better you can have a darker top lip a darker bottom lip just so much now you do have to kind of work around with it a little bit because there is no sliders for this it is 100 percent worth it they also have a bunch of other different overlays that you can use as well everything is linked below on their tumblr you can download all of that but yeah this lip preset is really really nice and i know this looks weird like this outline kind of looks weird but i promise you on the right lip it will eat down let's try Let's see, maybe like a little NQ. I know that kind of looks a little crazy, but I mean, it kind of eats, right? Like if you want like a little lip overline aesthetic, I don't know. Oh my gosh, even with the glosses, like you can really see the difference with the gloss. All right, we're gonna just do it with the gloss then. We're gonna go through, oh my God, we're gonna go through all these with the gloss because obviously, do y'all see that definition? Okay, so this is without it, right? No definition. And then this is with the lip mask. Oh my God, y'all see that? Y'all see that natural lip line? Oh my God, this is so pretty. Definitely pair this with just the Peachy Fairy gloss. I don't think that the details really work the best when it comes to like an actual lipstick. But, oh my god, this gloss is everything. Wow, I really, really, really love this. I'm gonna blur it out, y'all, but we're gonna go back into the tattoos and we're gonna actually layer the Peachy Fairy lip glosses. Now, I might actually keep the other lip gloss in the tattoo section just so I can layer it. I think that's a really good idea. If you don't want to put both of them in the same category, Put one in the lip category and then put the other in the tattoo category or whichever category you want to where you can find it and then layer it. I'm like, I really like that nice layered look because it adds a lot of dimension. So we're going to just choose this one. This is so freaking cute, y'all. That is the end of this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. These are all free. All of the links are in my bio. But thank you guys so much. We're almost at a thousand subscribers. So I appreciate you guys so much for the love and support. If y'all haven't already, make sure y'all subscribe and like the video because it helps me a lot. The final thing is check out my Twitter. Okay, symmetrical. And I will have all of my sim creations there, all of my everything, all of the behind the scenes, everything you guys need to know. But thank you guys so much. I appreciate you guys. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye. Oh, 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 oh,